Hey, just real quick for any of you guys that are uh, big Twitch viewers or video gamers or gaming streamers, all that sort of thing, uh, Amazon Prime, those of you that don't know, if you were an Amazon Prime membership uh, person that paid the $120 a year, part of your Amazon Prime membership included two perks for video games and, and that video game genre. One was you got 20% off of any video game purchases on pre-orders. They're taking that away. Number two is that if you watch Twitch on a regular basis, as a Prime member, you didn't have to view advertisements. People who do streaming on Twitch get paid through those advertisements, similar to here on YouTube. It's a little different, but um, it, it, same idea. And so people that have a Prime membership did not have to watch ads. Uh, if you didn't have a Prime membership, you had to pay nine bucks a month for something called Twitch Turbo. It's just a premium service that removes the ads. Well, Amazon is discontinuing that perk for Prime members. If you're a Prime member now, you still have to watch ads on Twitch. The only way around it is to give Twitch your $9 directly to pay for Twitch Turbo. Basically, Amazon was covering the cost of that Twitch Turbo. They're no longer going to do that. Take you over to the site. I'll show you what I'm talking about. And uh, I know most of you aren't going to care about this, but this was a huge story. And I watch Twitch uh, a little bit, a fair amount when I can. Um, again, I wish I had more time. but uh, And it's kind of obnoxious because I am a Prime member of Amazon and I don't uh, like watching ads unless I can at all um, help it. If I want to help somebody get paid that I enjoy their videos, like on YouTube or Twitch, I can just donate to them. Uh, you know, if you ever want to support this channel or support any of your favorite YouTubers, you can just straight donate to them um, using super chats or donate buttons or, or get the PayPal address. Uh, I'd rather not watch ads. Besides the point, advertisements pay pennies. It takes a thousand people to watch an ad just to get any sort of ad revenue. So remember that. Um, anyways, let's go over to my computer and I'll show you the, uh, the changes that Amazon made on the Prime membership today. Okay, so here we go with the Business Insider website, another website I watch pretty regularly. Uh, this is from today and it says Amazon just removed one of the best features from Amazon Prime and Twitch users are furious. If you're not familiar with Twitch, it started off as a video gaming streaming website. It's similar to like YouTube Live, but you could go in and select the video game you want to watch and then you could just watch people play that video game all day live. Um, they've since expanded it to people that do IRL, which means in real life streaming, people that are walking around streaming their real life. They do crafts, they do DIY, they do you know, video game and esports entertainment and news. So they have all kinds of different things you can watch. If you've never checked out twitch.tv, make sure you do. It's not twitch.com, it's twitch.tv. Um, so anyways, one of the uh, benefits of being an Amazon Prime member had to do with Twitch, which was ad-free Twitch viewing. So when you're over on Twitch, people that use Twitch uh, to make money, they get paid the same as YouTube. If an advertisement runs, they get paid. Well, part of being a Prime member and one of the, the lures that Amazon pulled in more Prime members with was we'll let you guys go on Twitch and see all of your favorite video games or streamers or whatever you're watching with no advertisements. Um, the Twitch people would still get paid from advertisements from the non Prime members, but all the Prime members didn't have to watch the ads. So now they've gotten rid of that. They're also getting rid of the 20% discount when you pre-order video games. This is huge. It's making the video game uh, industry go nuts because they used to give 20% on pre-orders for new video games. Now they're giving you a $10 credit that you have to mail in weeks and weeks later. So pretty annoying for those people. Um, any Twitch viewers who want to continue with their ad-free experience will have to pay for a service called Twitch Turbo. It's basically just like a premium membership to Twitch. It's like nine or 10 bucks a month. And then they can continue to watch all of their favorite streaming with no advertisements. Um, the video streaming company explained the change in a blog post Monday saying it reevaluated some of the existing Twitch Prime memberships. And of course, there was a lot of backlash on Twitter and Facebook about it. Uh, you can scroll down and read the rest of the story. Uh, it is $9 a month to stay on Twitch Turbo to keep rid of those ads. But a lot of people on, on social media, including Reddit, were just saying that Amazon is being greedy by not continuing to cover that ad-free cost because that's basically what Amazon was doing. So I thought some of you guys that um, would be interested in video games or Twitch or watch Twitch would want to know about that. Of course, if you are a Prime member, that just sucks for you and you've lost it. Uh, I am Prime member, but I don't watch a whole lot of Twitch uh, time to time. Again, if I had time to watch Twitch to watch video gamers, I would certainly have time to play them, which I don't. I work too much, uh, but that's kind of the life that I chose. So anyways, those of you interested in that, there's your little mini story for the day. Amazon removing uh, ad-free viewage on Twitch and 
getting rid of Amazon Prime, getting rid of the 20% discount on video game pre-orders. Sorry be the be- to be the bearer of bad news, you guys, but that's it from me today. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you guys then.